Hello and good news as always, my fellow subscribers. My name is Ultima. Welcome to your Finding Faces to the season one finale of Ruby Chibi. This has been a fantastic series that I thought originally wasn't going to be all that, but sure enough, this took me for a pleasant surprise. And I hope you are excited to see what's going to be taking place here in the finale before we get into volume four of Ruby. With that said, let's have some fun here. Here we go. All right, let's do it. It is go time. Ruby Chibi is presented in front of a live studio audience. I feel like I'm watching an episode of Seinfeld. Ruby? <laughs> Yang, what are you looking at? Looking at the boys? Blake reading her fanfiction? And Wyskin annoyed as she tries to do her homework? Sounds like a typical day at Team Ruby. Are you doing okay, Weiss? She's so salty. probably see a doctor about that cough. Wow. You know, it was probably just be easier to go study at the library. True. I don't want to go to the library. I want to study here, in my room. Well, you're gonna have to deal it's with Ruby. All of our room. True. Yang, what are you even doing? Oh, well, the boys' fight class is about to let out. I think I could see the showers from here. You are a peeping what? Tom! No, you can't. <laughs> oh, see, my. I told you. <laughs> okay. I can see in. Oh. Yang, you're terrible. Wow. <laughs> you're the one still looking. <laughs> Someone is coming in. Who is it? Who My is it? Nice little freak. Professor what? Port. <laughs> I'm blind. I'm blind. <laughs> My eyes. Today My leg. Possibly get worse. Hello, Team Ruby. Hey, John. What's up, player? <sighs> Try and get Weiss. Hey, John. We should be getting What's with Pira. Hello. Want. What's up? Well, here it comes. Yeah. I heard that you don't have a date to the dance coming up, God. so I thought I'd stop by. No. <laughs> you hopeless romantic. No, but uh, you don't even know what I was going to ask. <sighs> okay, fine. What were you going to ask? Like she hasn't heard this. I was this gonna ask if I could take you to the dance. Sorry, so but no. You want to know if I'll go to the dance with you? Yeah. Well, what do you think I'm going to say? <laughs> Wait for I it. I think you're going to say no. Swing and a miss. Give with Pira. I guess you can't win them all. Don't. This is not Pokemon. You. What are you doing? It's a long story. Nice pun. <laughs> Women are not like Pokemon. You can't catch them all. I'm Everyone sorry. Everyone knows that a pre-fight meal is the most important. That's why I always turn to pumpkin peats, marshmallow flakes. Before a match. We all know you don't like that cereal. Garbage. Yep. <laughs> mm. Taste that? That tastes like victory. She's lying. Don't Open believe her. Marshmallow flakes. The tasty treat that'll toughen your tummy. <laughs> tasty. Right? Tastes like ass. <laughs> I remember a simpler time. A time when three flavors of ice cream were all you needed. Hey, Roman That's Neo. I stuck with Neo's Neo. <laughs> really? So don't listen to our competitors. Try Neo's Neo today. <laughs> it's definitely not poison. He's lying. Morning. Neo's Neapolitan ice cream is considered a hazard by the Remnant Food Bureau. Eat at your own risk. Wow. It's probably poison. <laughs> I love Neo. Oh my goodness. I'd eat if it well, wasn't poison. Looks like the end of the year dance was a success. Hey. Nailed it. Hey, that's my line. True. Uh, hey, Blake. Hey, what's up, playa? Big pimping over Hello, here. Son. Hey. You know, I got two tickets to the gun show if you want to join me on the dance floor. You cornball. <laughs> That's the cheesiest thing I've ever heard. Thank you, but it worked. Okay. It worked! Score. No Wait. swing and a miss. I want to go to a gun show. What? You promised the next free time you had, we'd get to hang out. Just Neptune. Just guys, keeping it real. What's more awesome and manly than a gun show? No, Dude. that's not what I meant. Oh no, I'm not taking no for an answer. You hot blocking! Oh my okay. Neptune! You win some, you lose some. Swing and a miss. Hey, wasn't Team Juniper supposed to be here with the cake? They were? Yeah, cake? I told Nora to bring cake. Nora? That's a, you did not ask Norlax. <laughs> no. Hey, didn't there used to be an exit here? Norlax. No, don't! Gone. <laughs> <laughs> I know you said cake twice, but you didn't say one guy. 
God damn it, Norlax. Mind if we borrow your scythe to cut up and serve some slices? I guess. Okay, but be careful. Remember, it's also a gun. This is so sitcom. <laughs> love it. Love it, love it. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you so much for coming out tonight. Yeah, Wait, is... Ah, nice. Ruby Chibi, I guess you could say, is a sitcom through and through. Lo and behold. Ah, uh, look at the... Amazing! He works everywhere! God dang it! Cute smile. Can't wait to see everyone at Volume 4. Duh. We're awesome. And that is the Season 1 to Ruby. I hope you all were- Ooh, swoo, red versus blue. Ooh, we're gonna be doing that tomorrow! Hope you guys are hyped for the fa finale for that because that's approximately 23 minutes long. Ooh, get your popcorn and snacks ready, everyone, because my guy is going to be... Ooh, it's going to be exciting. I hope, man, I can't wait for Volume 4. It's time. Speaking of Volume 4, now that we got to this point of it, I want to ask you all and a question for you all to answer in the comment section. I realized that the intro to Volume 4 came out about a day ago, I guess, on the Rooster Teeth website. Did it come out on YouTube as well? I think it did. Yeah, it did as well. It's only like a minute long. Do you want to see that individually from me, or do you want me to wait and just kind of add it in combination with Episode 1? I don't know. I haven't seen the introduction. I'm not sure if it's going to be redundant if I were to combine the two together or if it's going to be very nice and transitional. The introduction will pretty much seem transition flawlessly to episode one. I'm not sure. I don't know what episode one's going to be like. I haven't even seen the intro. That's why I'm asking you because I'm sure you've seen it. Do you want me to cover it sometime soon? Or do you want me to wait until episode one comes out and I'll just add the two together? Let me know in the comment section down below. I'd love to hear your feedback. So with that said, that was season one of Ruby Chibi. And I hope you all were able to enjoy and appreciate this amazing animated series through and through. I would love to thank the animators for working so hard, so consistently to bring both Red vs. Blue season 14 and also Ruby Chibi all while at the same time, probably working on season 15 of Red vs. Blue and also Volume 4 of Ruby. I hope you guys are excited for the future. And there's one more thing, Jackie, that I want to bring to your all your guys' attention. So, Red vs. Blue is going to be over soon. I don't think they're going to be posting Red vs. Blue while Vol Volume 4 of Ruby's coming up. I want to ask you, would you like to see Camp Camp? A lot of you have been asking for this, but I know that I should bring this to your attention. If you want to see that in the future, let it be known in the comments down below, and I'll make a note of it, because if there is enough response to it, I will indeed cover it. But that's up to you, not up to me. On this note, I hope you guys were able to enjoy yourself as much as I did, and if you did, then please make sure to leave a like or a dislike down below. Either way, it helps out support the channel, and I wholeheartedly appreciate your support. On this note, my name is Ultima. You guys are awesome, and I will see you in the next video. Whatever I decide to make, it can be absolutely anything. Thank you all so much for watching. I can never say this enough. Thank you. And thank you to Rooster Teeth for making such incredible animations. I really, really do appreciate it.